You're always the most beautiful woman in the room. <laughs> I like that. Would you like to come visit me this Sunday? Yes, yes I would. You went away with her, right? What happened? You're in a trance. I'm wide awake. I've never been more awake in my life. Why don't you leave me alone? Carol is set in the early 1950s, and it follows the unexpected love affair between two women of different ages and different social settings. It's a very subtle, delicate aesthetic that Todd is working with. The atmosphere is palpable, all those beautiful reflections. So you have, you know, a peopled landscape, but it's reflected by all the iconography of, of the 50s. It's almost like a pale, ghostly shadow to what's going on in the rich interior life of the characters. They actually often recede within the reflection of the society in which they're inhabiting. In this film, more than other films I've made where I've drawn from the cinema of a particular period. We really were looking more at the period photography, this kind of soft, soiled, beautifully muted color palette that we really tried to bring to the visual sensibility of the film. I think Todd does this beautiful mix of hyper-reality mixed with hyper-cinematic uh, fantasy and beauty. It swirls together in this way where you feel like you're watching something that is so hyper-real and yet incredibly cinematic. We shot the film on Super 16 to preserve the grain of celluloid. This really looks like a film from the time that we were conveying. So that was also cool, the small camera, and uh, do it in some ways with that sort of gorilla sensibility that we, that we all came out of. So I'm going to just have you come straight from there. Okay. So you, you know, this <laughs> takes so many people to make a movie, you know, hundreds of people. The odds that everyone is actually trying to make the same film are statistically small. Uh, but in this case, it did really feel as though we all actually were pointing towards the same result. Everybody has done their best and just all the components work together. The arm will extend all the way out. Of course, it's all credit to Todd for putting together the right combination of people, but providing the inspiration. Todd has this great generosity of spirit. Like there's no, um, you know, protecting his homework. He invites you into all of the, the visual references. And then we have a B camera on you. The perspective of the film, the color palette. Oh, okay, so it's kind of just where I pass Exactly. Not only a visual mood board, but like kind of an interior soundtrack. It gives you a sense of the emotional kind of through line of the film, the interior life, which was so important playing characters like Therese and Carol, because it's all so subterranean and often music in all Todd's films is such a vital kind of character. Carol is certainly a film about a love affair between two women, but I also think it's about the radicality of love to begin with. You see how love, on the one hand, can open us up, and then it can shut us down. And we, in some ways, are never the same. 